Hey guys, how's it going? My name's Dan and welcome to another Mobile Suit demonstration video. Today I'm going to be covering the Kabakali from DLC 6. Let's get started. The head, body, arms, legs and backpack have invisible titanium, which increases durability by 20%, photon battery, which increases the thruster capacity by 5000, and photon balancer, which increases cancel combo damage by 10%. The legs with built-in shields have physical resistant armour, large, which increases physical guard by 8%, and beam resistant armour, large, which increases beam guard by 8%. The Kabakali can be bought in HG scale in the shop once you've gathered enough HG parts. And the Kabakali can be found in DLC 6 Mission 5 as a mid-boss. Alright, let's see what the Kabakali can do. First off is the melee weapon, the Beam Ring. It uses the standard whip moveset. It has fast attacks and long range but probably has the weakest attack of all weapon types. The ranged weapon is the Beam Shotgun. It has quite a few interesting mixes of abilities, but the one I'm using has fire single shot for R1, you fire a single shot that upon reaching a certain distance spreads into a shotgun shot and fire special shot for hold R2. You fire an explosive shot that explodes on impact, damaging surrounding enemies. Moving on to the optionals, we have the Beam Sabers. It shares the same moveset as the Beam Sabers from the Age FX when pressing circle. At the end of the combo, or by holding circle, you perform a charge slash. It doesn't seem to do much more damage as usual, but it has longer range, and appears to have a higher chance of breaking parts. There is a short period where you cannot move after attacking, leaving you wide open to damage. Next up are the beam rings. You throw two beam rings that can attack two separate enemies. When they hit an opponent, they'll be damaged and stunned for a long time. And finally, we have the chest photon laser cannon. Hold circle to fire beam irradiation. And that's everything on the Kabakali. It's a cool looking suit, but it's a bit light on the functions. If you found this video useful or informative, drop it a like, and subscribe to keep up to date with my latest videos. And until next time guys, catch you later!